like, boy, it was hot here today. I know. Welcome to Florida in the summertime, y'all. It's just so gross here right now. Yeah. <laughs> you got me off. You got me off. <laughs> You're about to turn me off. Sarah. <laughs> Sarah. Hi everyone, and welcome back to Java Talk. Where we talk about anything and everything. I'm Sarah. And I'm Ryan. Oh, yes. Oh. <laughs> Get that awkward back in. Are you gonna sit? Oh, it's I'm, not it's, even a real chair. It's hot. It is hot. Can you see the steam? I, yeah. Do you see the steam coming off my undercarriage? <laughs> you see the steam heater rifle. <laughs> <laughs> if you're just joining us, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications. Everyone, we are back. Sarah is post baby, as all of you know. He's happy and healthy, he's eight weeks old. When did he turn eight weeks old? Uh, Well, like two weeks ago. He's 10 weeks? He's 10 weeks. Are you sure? Yeah. Have you been gone that long? Mm-hmm. Oh, I thought he was eight weeks. Nope, he's 10 weeks. I go back to <sighs> work. I'm back to work. Yeah, that's awful. I mean, <laughs> I meant awesome. You know, That's Big Mom got to make a paycheck somehow, you know. Make a paycheck. Today's coffee is brought to you by, excuse the lawn mower. I mean, who mows their lawn at uh, 9 o'clock in the morning on Monday? Anyway, today's coffee is brought to you. Did you want to do the coffee? What's... Oh, okay. Well, I got this coffee off of Amazon. So, um, I don't know exactly where it hails from. Colorado. Oh, you found that where? Yep. It's right here. Oh, okay. Hails from Colorado. It's called Wake the Hell Up Coffee, and it's got extra caffeine. Okay. I'm lying. That's where the logo was created. Oh, see, but it's yeah. called uh, Wake the Hell Up. This is the first time I've ever had it. It's good. I like it's it. It's very good. I really, really enjoy I it. I got it off of Amazon. It had, like, extra caffeine. Yep. It's ultra caffeinated, 100% all-natural coffee. Wake the Hell Up. It is from Utica, New York. I really like it. You like it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's good. It's strong. I like it. Did you brew it strong? Or I, is it just strong? I just regular I regular brewed it. Yeah, it's it's hearty. Yeah. Wow, it is hot in here today. It's really not. It's 74 in my house. I think Brian just runs a little st Well, yeah. Everybody, meet baby Colt. Hi! Oh baby Colt couldn't sleep very long. You wanna say <laughs> hi? So cute. Do you wanna make your debut? On the old Java talk, talk um, of the Java. You want to drink some coffee? Huh? <laughs> He's cute as can be. Look at his Me big old cheeks. Well, it's 10 weeks. He's doing good. He's cute as can be. So, during our sabbatical, a lot happened. Obviously, I birthed a child, I created life. Um, and then Ryan. Yes. Got to meet. Paula. Yeah, you know everybody knows I have a thing for Paula Abdul, right? Well, I went to Orlando for a week to Tremaine Dance Convention, which was by far the best dance convention I've ever been to um, since I started going when I was like 10, 9, 10 years old. Um, I met Paula Abdul. I got to take a picture with her. I posted that on Facebook and Instagram a couple of weeks ago, and I got to speak with her and share with her that she's my inspiration, you know, that kind of stuff. This is real life, guys. I have three kids. Life. kids. <laughs> okay, come on, Cora. Let's just introduce all the kids all at once. Hello. This is Cora. This Hi. is my oldest. Are you okay with this? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's Cora. And She's then Claire's the over here. Scoot and Claire. And then Claire. There's Claire. And then baby Cole. This is real life, guys. This is <laughs> this is how it happens. <laughs> This is now the only one left is oh, rusty this is trombone. We'll, uh, this is where pro procreation will get you. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know how to practice. <laughs> so anyway, Tremaine is like the best I've ever been to. It's filled with nothing but like thousands of people. It looked really, it looked really cool. Like very it like high energy. High energy, love, like uplifting, super, super, um, I don't know. The It was like just full of energy. So if you are a dance instructor or a dance student or a mom with kids that are looking for a uh, convention, go on to Tremaine and check them out. It looks really nice. It's the greatest. You wanna hold it? Yeah, hold I, it. Do I wanna hold it? No, I said hold him. Oh, I thought you said it. I didn't say it. Well, I hold it. I hold it? I hold it on hold a tag. it like a champ. It's mm -hmm. like your Uncle Ryan. You like your Uncle Ryan. Maybe. Yeah. So, I had people ask me about my earrings recently, and I just wanted to post on here that 
I follow Twisted Sister on Facebook. Her name is Nikki. All of this stuff that she makes is handmade. These are like rose gold. They're so, they're, great. they're lightweight. Like, look at me. Look at me. I'm not weighed down. Anyways, I just wanted to give her like a shout out because I think she makes a great product. She And I, this is not sponsored. I'm not making any money. I just really like her stuff. And I just wanted to kind of say. Twisted Sister? Twisted Sister. On Facebook. On, on Facebook. And awesome. um, you buy, a right. you just, and then you can stash stuff. So if like you find like multiple styles that you like, you can just be like, hey, stash them for me. And she stashes them. And then she invoices people like, um, like at the end of the week. So she's really cool. Very sweet. And Does she, she have anything for guys? Um, no, not right now. Just, you yeah. know. Yeah. And she doesn't just do the, the danglies. She has studs. She has drizzles, I think is what they're called. I, or no, whatever. And that drizzle, was drizzle. I don't, I don't. Whatever. Anyways, they're really pretty. All of her stuff is really pretty. Oh, sweet boy. He is a sweet boy. So, if you guys follow us on Instagram and Facebook, which you should be following us on Instagram and Facebook, just saying, because we do post periodically. Anyways, if you're following us, you guys know that I came up with the awesome idea to start a weight loss challenge. So awesome. I am well, the weight loss challenge was great. I was like, yeah, we'll do it together. And then was, you turned it into a like full-on competition, Team Ryan, Team Sarah. I totally did. Which is, that's okay, because I'm super competitive. Team Ryan or Team Sarah, go make your choice on Facebook, because I think it's open for like five more days. Anywho, mm -hmm. we're going to do a weight loss challenge, Ryan and I. I am post-baby. Also, in our last video, I told you guys that I was doing Weight Watchers. I am, and I love it. I don't know what Ryan's going to do, but I'm going to continue to do my Weight Watchers. Um, I haven't figured it out yet. Okay. I haven't. But to make this even, because obviously guys lose more weight than females when they're starting to lose weight. I don't know if you all know that. And it's really annoying for us females that guys lose more weight quicker. Um, we are going to do this by body percentage. We're going to do it by percentage. So what we do is our weight that we lose at the end of four weeks, we're going to do this for four weeks. The weight that we lose for four weeks, we're going to divide that by our starting weight mm -hmm. and then times that times 100 and you get your percentage of weight loss. Right. So that's how we're going to make it e yeah. e even. And whoever has the highest percentage of weight loss wins. Which would be me. Sarah won the, we put a poll on Facebook and Sarah won the Facebook, or the Instagram, Instagram. sorry, Instagram. Sarah won the Instagram poll 60 to 40, but right now I'm ahead on um, On Facebook. Facebook. Yeah, so, so it's all right. I am ready. So Sarah's weighing. We are not, I am not giving our weight right but we will be honest. Sorry, we not will know this each on a social Yeah, we'll media know platform. each other's weight, but we will not we will not um you know, we're not going to let the public know. Oh, now it's working. Okay, now it's working. I got a fussy baby. That's okay. okay. You know what yours is? Got it. All right. Like Sorry about the crying, guys. He's just hungry. That's all right. How do I do this? You just step on it. Okay. Well, I don't think this is correct. Oh. All right. I got it. You're good? Yeah. You got to write it down. Oh, Sarah. Hey. Any, any final words you want to say to cameras over here? I, I mean, it's on like Donkey Kong. She's ready to lose. I'm so ready to lose. <laughs> like... No, lose. No, I mean, like, lose. Wait, ass. Yeah, I'm talking about lose the challenge. No, yeah, you probably will. Yeah. Well, we, we weighed ourselves. Our weight is recorded, and I'm super pumped up to do this challenge for everybody, and you know, keep track of it and share with everybody. Because, like I said in a uh, Facebook post, there's nothing, you know, like being held accountable on social media platform where hundreds of people, maybe thousands. I'd probably say thousands. Yeah. You know. Of people are watching us. Can you bring it real like this, Sarah? <laughs> Thank you again for tuning in, everyone. Uh, stay tuned for the weight loss challenge. We'll be updating every week or so and on social media if you want to stay tuned. Uh, like I always say, <laughs> what? I don't know. What do I always What say? do you always say? <laughs> <laughs> Hit that subscribe button, comment, like, and share, and we will see you next time with a new video. Bye, guys. Bye.